Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In the next 5 minutes, I will guide you on creating a read more read less button using only HTML and CSS. That's right, we won't be using any JavaScript or any plugin. So without any further ado, let's get started with the tutorial. We begin with the HTML code. First, we have a container div that holds our content. Inside the container, we have two paragraphs. The first paragraph has the class original and contains some lorem ipsum text. I am generating this text using emmet. You can just copy paste some random text. Now I will paste the extra text into another paragraph element. The class for this paragraph element is extra. Now just paste the extra text into this paragraph element. Next we have span element with the class dots. This element represents the ellipses that we want to display as visual indicator. Ellipses as in the three dots. Now let us create an input type checkbox with the id btn. Next we have label that corresponds to this checkbox that's the only HTML we are going to need let's move on to CSS moving on to CSS we start by defining some styles the extra class sets a display property to none which means the paragraph with extra class is initially hidden the p selector sets the display property to inline for paragraphs allowing them to appear next to each other. Then we have styles for checkbox and the label elements. The checkbox is customized to have a height of 2 em and no default appearance. The height of 2 em ensures that the checkbox doesn't overlap with any text. Now coming to the label, the label has a position set to relative padding of 1 em for spacing and a background color of black you can use any background color of your choice and a white text color we also set the cursor to pointer to indicate it's clickable the label before selector adds the text read more before the label content now comes the interesting part we use the selector input type checkbox checked till the label before to target the pseudo element before the label when the checkbox is checked inside this selector we change the content to read less so when the checkbox is checked the label text magically transforms from read more to read less. Let us see this in working. It works perfectly. Now to maintain a clean appearance we hide the dots when the checkbox is checked using the dots has tilde input type checkbox checked selector. So what this selector basically does is checks if input type checkbox is checked. If it is checked, it hides the dots. Let's see this in working as well. As you can see, the dots appear and disappear as we click on the read more, read less button. Finally, we reveal the hidden paragraph with the class extra when the checkbox is checked. We use this following selector for this purpose. I know these selectors may sound overwhelming, but once you learn how they work, they are super easy. And there you have it. With this code, we have created a simple read more feature using checkboxes and CSS. Users can click the read more button to toggle the visibility of the extra content. Now isn't that cool? I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Don't forget to click 
the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more such exciting web development content. Until next time, happy coding!